What are you doing this weekend on your weekend off? Um, spending some time with the family. We we'll, we'll basically take have a day off uh, on Saturday. We're watching watching college football. Watch everybody else stress. Um, and uh, and try to catch the. I'm gonna have to record the Eagles game tonight, but catch them in action and and uh, yeah, recharge. General thoughts on these three days? Uh, general thoughts, good. We got some some productive work in for, for everybody. Um, I thought today the older guys practiced their best of the week, which is probably a good thing, uh, just from a, a confidence standpoint, rhythm standpoint, timing, all the things that we tried to, to, to keep fresh and get better with those guys. Uh, a bunch, a bunch of work today, especially with the twos and threes team wise, which was great. Those guys never, never get that many reps during the year normally, and, and uh, uh, got a ton. So, so pleased. At what point do you start preparing for Cal being a Cal film? We've already looked at all of it and, and a little bit of game planning, but, but uh, the, the, the nuts and bolts of that was certainly going on on uh, Monday. And, and we try to, for the, for the players, you know, that was part of our, our strategy going in this, is keep, keep next week as much of the normal game week as possible. Um, they are creatures of habit, and they like that. You know, they do this on Monday, this on Tuesday, this on Wednesday. And, and uh, so from, from their standpoint, it would be worse than that. The coaches have already we've gotten a ton of fun with I can't imagine as a coordinator, offense or defense, you're not there a lot of stress in season. Do you feel more stress or busier or is your I think everybody's under stress. I mean, you might even occasionally have stress. Is it a commercial today? Is it a radio show? That's your stress, right? Golf? No, I think I think every every coach at every level, if, if they care about, you know, you care about your players so much, you care about preparing your players so much, that that's, that's stressful. You know, you, you, wanna, you want them to have as, as great of an experience as possible, and, and anything that you can do to promote that or, or you know, help those guys in any way, you're, you're trying to find that, that edge, and that's kind of an ongoing uh, stressor at any level. How are you guys doing the bye week this differently this year than last year? Um, just we're, we're using it a little bit more as a developmental period for our younger guys. We're still, we still did a lot of stuff with our older guys. Um, it was something that Rad and I sat down and tried to, we're trying to have it, you know, have maximum impact as far as being a keeping the routine the same for the you know, game week part of it, and then maybe six, seven, eight, nine, ten weeks down the road, we'll get it off.